first big announcement at the show is Aspera Files. It is our first software as a service platform. For now, a number of years, Aspera has been involved in helping media companies take their workflows to the cloud. And we've been working with every major cloud provider um, on the marketplace. Amazon Web Services, Microsoft Azure, Google Cloud, and also IBM SoftLayer Cloud. Um, but it was m mostly an on-demand implementation of our software. So it was like a choice from the customer to either run it on, in their facility or in the cloud or both. But we ha we've had quite a few requests to actually uh, provide a fully managed uh, software as a service platform, which is a spare files that we're bringing to market now. And some of the great things about files uh, are that, first of all, it has a spare. So the scale, the security, the performance that we're known for are now built into this software as a service platform. Although it will be run on the IBM SoftLayer cloud, so you can choose to put your content in the SoftLayer cloud, we'll provide the storage for you. Um, you can also choose to put your storage wherever you want. Uh, it will talk to the other clouds. It will talk to your own storage. So the choice is yours. You can basically just put your content wherever it's most appropriate for you, and then to, to the user it will be completely transparent. If you're using software as a service to move content in production, uh, security is extremely important. And so we've done a huge amount of work to make sure that it, everything is fully secure using all of the security paradigms that Aspera has already, but also building new ways for companies and partners to collaborate on very specific workspaces. So if your company wants to invite you know, if let's say you're a studio and you want to invite one of your key post-production facilities uh, to work together in a workspace, you can do so securely or actually exclude them completely if you want to make sure they, don't, they can't touch specific content. So that's the Spare Files. We are announcing it at NAB. There will be a, a beta program that we're going to be running with some of our top customers over the next few months and we expect to make it publicly available later in this year. Another big thing for us is our fast stream technology. So it used to be that Aspera could only take a finished file and move it somewhere. And we couldn't deal with growing files. And we've made that happen, which now allows us to stream video uh, reliably, securely, and at the highest level of performance possible, because it still uses our transport mechanism. Fast stream was at the core of all of the second screen experiences for the FIFA World Cup last year. It was very, very exciting. Uh, and now on the show floor, we're showing uh, actually a live demo of Fast Stream. We had a, one of our customers in New York City put a camera in, uh, in one of their offices facing Times Square. So we're showing Times Square um, straight from the camera, um, full resolution HD over a 10 megabit per second link, which is very, very slow. <laughs> Um, with no artifacts, no glitches, no rebuffering, and with only about 400 milliseconds delay. So FastStream, it's a set of APIs, so it's basically we work with companies that want to implement that capability into a service, a solution, or others. It's not a packaged product we sell, um, but we've got a lot of interest, and actually it's just been natively implemented into Telestream's Vantage orchestration platform. And uh, that's that's very cool. And finally, we you know I mentioned an integration with a partner, and I think that's a nice segue into talking about how Spera has become a, a transport platform for a lot of companies uh, in the media technology space. And here on the booth, we have 12 of our partners. Um, I think in total, there's more than 100 uh, solutions that have a Spera either built in or that are compatible with a Spera. But really cool things being shown today. Uh, we have Akamai showing their spare upload uh, option. So for Akamai customers, they need to put uh, their content in the cloud. They have an option to do it much faster with an spare transport. We uh, are showing Telestream Vantage. We have VizRT uh, showing their Viz1 solution that's now been uh, ported to the cloud. And obviously, when you put something in the cloud, you have to move uh, your data as fast as possible. Uh, and it's all built onto uh, the IBM SoftLayer cloud as well, which is cool. 
Uh, we have Grass Valley showing the Stratus product line, which also has a spare embedded. So it's, it's for us, it's extremely rewarding to see that these top companies are choosing our transport platform uh, to provide their customers with the best possible experience.